In this lesson, we will see how we can use label detection with Cloud Vision in UiPath. Having configured the Cloud Vision scope, we go to Activities, Google, under Vision, and then we we'll choose the Label Detection. Let's talk briefly about what Label Detection is. So Label Detection looks in a picture. Let us take this picture for example, and then it tells us what in it this picture there's a panda and bamboos and so and then it gives us a um, how accurate uh, it think that it is that there's a panda panda will probably rate quite high and uh, some other things will rate quite low so let's create that we'll first take this panda picture so let me close it down i will path uh, choose the path and i placed mine on the desktop that's this picture i click open then we will output it to an array of labels. So we go up here, Control K, A R R of labels. So now we can uh, loop through all the labels that Google says that there is in the picture. So find a for each. We will drag this guy in. First, we will choose the type argument. Go down to browse for types. Let me drag this in. Labels. Label, sorry. Here. And then we will need to find the Google Vision models. Label here. And then click OK. Now we can say for each label in the array of labels here. Then we want to print out what's in this label. So we find a right line. And remember, we can have more tags on the same picture. That could be a, a, a panda, a bamboo, or, or a yeah, banana, whatever that there's in this zoo picture. So I'll drag in a right line. First, we will print out the name. So that is name. And then we can say plus, and then we'll say label. Then we press a dot. And now we can see that we can have a name or a score. Choose the name first, like this. Then we will print out the score. So with a space here, then we will say score, colon, like this. And again, label, and then we choose the score, like this. So what's... Um, label.score.string, like this. Now we can run the file. Google looks at the picture and we can go down to output. We can see that it by almost 100% uh, certainty, that is uh, when it's close to one, it thinks that it's a panda. It also thinks that it's a mammal. Um, a bear is also quite likely. Sue is quite likely. Uh, what is not that likely? That could be a, a plant, national park. We can see carnivore, wildlife. So uh, it does a pretty good job here. Let's try to um, choose another picture. I have two more pictures we can choose from. This footballer here. So we will just go in here and on the desktop we will choose this picture. We will click open. We don't have to change anything. Could of course, of course, also create a loop. Oh, we need to probably close it down here. So um, now we have the output, and here we can see that we have a green, the color green. That's quite likely. Then we have a kick. Yeah, right. Sport, grass, sports training, and actually we don't have a football yeah football it's only with 50 percent certainty and why is that that's probably maybe because we can't see a ball oh uh, yeah we could but um, maybe it's because this goal that's a handball goal i don't know then we can try the last picture that was the girl with the umbrella from before so we'll just uh, go up here desktop and then we'll choose this picture and now we can run it We go down to output and we can see here that we have uh, an umbrella with a quite certain uh, wood not that certain yellow well the whole picture was yellow so uh, yeah and you can see happy 
that's actually also somewhat likely. And you can uh, classify all your unknown images like this. In this lesson, you learned how to use label detection with Cloud Vision, with UiPath,